Are you ready to level up your gaming experience? Introducing Neuralink, the revolutionary technology that allows you to control your favorite video games with your mind. But it's not just about gaming. With Neuralink, you can imagine typing up an email or even controlling your smart home devices with just a thought. It's like having a superpower. Founded by Elon Musk and a team of neuroscientists, Neuralink is on a mission to create ultra-high bandwidth brain-machine interfaces. This technology is set to change the way we interact with technology and open up endless possibilities. One of the most exciting applications of Neuralink is its potential to help people with disabilities regain control of their limbs. With this technology, people could control prosthetic devices or even assistive technology with their mind. And that's just the beginning. Neuralink is also working on developing new ways to communicate, such as thought-to-text, which would allow people to type using only their brainwaves. The future is here, and it's looking bright with Neuralink. Join the revolution and imagine the possibilities. How does it work? The secret behind Neuralink is brain-machine interface, a technology that connects your brain to a computer. The device has tiny electrodes that are implanted in specific areas of your brain. These electrodes record your brain activity also known as brainwaves, and translate it into commands for the computer. For example, if you think about moving your arm, the electrodes will pick up on that brainwave and send a signal to a robotic arm to move. This technology has the potential to change the lives of people with disabilities, allowing them to control prosthetic devices or assistive technology with their mind. But it's not just about helping people with disabilities, it's also about taking our interaction with technology to the next level, such as thought to text, which would allow people to type using only their brainwaves. Neuralink has been conducting experiments with animals, such as monkeys and rats, to test the feasibility and safety of their technology. They have reported success in using brain-machine interfaces to control robotic arms and even restore movement in paralyzed limbs. Think about what kind of possibility this can have for people who are paralyzed, for example. With Neuralink's technique, a lot would be possible here. Do you think Neuralink's technique is going to change the world? Let us know in the comments. The company has also announced that they have plans to conduct human trials in the near future. However, the specific details of these trials, such as the timeline and the criteria for selecting participants, have not been made public. It's important to note that the technology is still experimental and not yet widely available. The company is currently working to refine the technology and address any potential safety concerns before making it available to the public. This technique is therefore not yet possible because there are still many studies to be done and the right personnel still need to be trained. Just a chip Yes, Neuralink's technology involves the implantation of a small device, often referred to as a chip, into the brain. This device contains a number of electrodes that are used to record brain activity as well as a small computer chip that processes the data and sends it to an external device. The device is typically implanted in the skull during a surgical procedure performed by a trained neurosurgeon. The electrodes are then inserted into specific areas of the brain, depending on the desired application. Once the device is implanted, it can be used to record brain activity and translate it into commands for a computer or other device. For example, if a person thinks about moving their arm, the electrodes in the device would record the corresponding brain waves and send a signal to a robotic arm to move. The procedure to implant Neuralink's device is a surgical procedure that typically requires general anesthesia. The procedure involves making an incision in the skull and then implanting the device inside the skull. The electrodes are then inserted into specific areas of the brain. The size of the incision and the overall invasiveness of the procedure would depend on the specific design of the device and the location in which it is implanted. However, it is considered a complex and invasive surgery, and it carries some risks such as infection, bleeding, or injury to the brain. It's important to note that the technology is still experimental, and the long-term effects of having such a device implanted in the brain are not yet known. The company is currently working to refine the technology and address any potential safety concerns before making it available to the public. Also, the procedure should only be performed by trained neurosurgeons. Elon Musk's Vision on Neuralink Elon Musk, one of the co-founders of Neuralink, believes that as AI becomes more advanced, 
It will be important for humans to have a way to directly interface with computers in order to remain competitive. That's where Neuralink comes in. With Neuralink, humans can have a direct link between the brain and computers, allowing them to keep pace with advancements in AI and potentially even merge with AI in the future. This technology not only allows us to take advantage of A's benefits, but also minimize the potential risks. It's about achieving a symbiosis between humans and AI. Neuralink is not only about gaming or controlling your smart home devices with a thought. It's about enhancing human capabilities and improving our quality of life. In addition to this, he also envisions the technology being used to help people with disabilities regain control of their limbs and to improve communication for people with speech or motor impairments. He also mentioned that in the future, the technology could be used for more advanced applications like telepathy or even merging human and AI consciousness. He also stated that the company aims to achieve a sort of symbiosis between humans and AI, where the two can work together to achieve things that are not possible for either one alone. He believes that the technology has the potential to greatly enhance human capabilities and ultimately improve our quality of life. Do you feel the same way about this as Elon Musk? Then like this video. Do you think this can never be a solution? Dislike this video. Thanks for watching this video. If you vote all the way to here, thanks for that. Did you think this was a good video and don't want to miss anything about technology on Earth or in space? Then subscribe to my channel. Stranger Binge, subscribe and find out.